because we might as well do a live on mine. Hey. All right, everybody. Say hello to my people. Hey. Hey, this is Kendrick. Hi. I'm here with Shailene. We're here with Sophia and Mike. We're all here at Jane Fonda's house. Yes, I said Jane Fonda. And um, we are here with the initiative to make sure that L.A. County jails get reformed. Um, there is a ballot that's at stake right now um, that we are trying to get 170,000 signatures for, correct? Yep. Um, but the uh, catch is, you know, with all the advanced technology, of course, there is no advanced technology to signing this, so you would have to sign it in person, which is... You know, so crazy, but you can go to LA, uh, reformlajails.com, right? Yeah, reformlajails.com. Reformlajails.com. Or, uh, Instagram, reformlajails, reform LA, the two letters. LA. Wait, on Instagram, Jail, if you put like a link uh, on the, dot, on the and, thing. And on Instagram, you, on um, Facebook, how do you Twitter, make it on like, Twitter, um, <gasps> and you can go to for, reformlajails.com, as yes. Lauren just said. So you can get more information on how you can yeah. sign this petition, but basically what oh. this petition oh. does oh, is it gives the, um, the Citizen Oversight, Citizen Oversight Committee, Committee. Um, it <gasps> gives them subpoena so power to... Um, okay, bring forward problematic LA, situations Jail, before the committee and actually request information yeah, and photo, stuff that they oh, cannot do right now. There's a citizen oversight committee that cannot subpoena, you know, certain cer- problematic to get, behavior. Problematic behavior to get to get information, just information. So this gives them power to do that, and it also um, looks at diff- uh, uh, alternatives to incarceration um, for mentally ill and homeless who make up a huge part of the population of the largest county jail system yeah. in the country, which is L.A. Right, and that's essentially the main point, which we, I, I'm sorry, I didn't give you guys any background, but yeah, so basically, L.A. County Jail is the largest jail system in the United States, which obviously sets a precedent for, in the world, <laughs> I'm sorry, in the world, which is in the United States, of course, right? Um, but basically, um, what we're all here to do is to talk about, um, talk about the way that we can make this better and we can and we can figure out different ways that we can not just imprison people and put them in a back burner and allow them to be brutalized in their in the system um there's a lot of people who have lost loved ones we heard three testimonies today from um parents of people who lost their children to 22 year olds which really hit home because i'm 22 um Oh, I'm 21, but I'm turning 22, and someone who lost their 24-year-old daughter who was left in a ravine, and that just to me, there's no um, justification in any way, shape, or form for mistreating any human, no matter what mistakes they've made in their past or what kind of transgressions any one of us deems is fit for um, brutal treatment, which is none. At the end of the day, none of us are, are God, and none of us are any sort of at any sort of level to hurt another human being in that kind of way. So um, we just really want to focus in on the communities that are affected by these things. So we're here as ally. I'm here as an ally. Um, we got Kendrick here. He has does such amazing work all over the place. You invited me to this. I'm very grateful. Thank you for having me. Thank you for coming. <laughs> but yeah, you guys will see um, a post on my Instagram soon about this. So to get more information so that you know where to go. But yeah, this is what I've been doing for the past couple hours. I've met so many incredible people here who are genuinely making change in their societies. And they're going out on the street and they're asking people to sign this petition. And, you know, there's people out here who really care about those who have been incarcerated and those are the family and loved ones of those who have been incarcerated because it's such a... You can also donate. Oh, fun fact. Donate. Give us money. Yeah, so yeah. <laughs> if you're not in L.A., um, because we need people who are registered in L.A. to sign the petition, um, to, who are registered to vote in L.A., which it, which spreads all the way to Long Beach and um, Hermosa Beach and, you know, uh, Pacific Palisades, all of L.A. County can sign this petition. But if you're not in L.A., you can go on reformlajails.com and donate because we need money. We need money to hire people to go out and collect signatures. We need we need your help. Yes, so like me, I, I, I'm not a L.A. citizen, so I donated. I signed the petition, but I didn't know I had to be an L.A. You see, <laughs> we're learning. As we go, we're learning. So I signed the petition, right? But if you are an L.A. citizen, you are much more useful to the cause than I am right now. So 
No, you sign? You, I'm just kidding. No, no we're, still, great. we're yeah. useful. So because we yeah. donate, I donated money. That's what that's what's necessary. If you got money just sitting around, and I mean, not all of us do, but if you happen if you to, or if mom and dad do, it matters. Dollars. Two dollars, yeah. five dollars. Like if you make your parents a latte cents. tomorrow, and they don't buy a four dollar coffee from Starbucks, and you give it to an initiative that needs your help, it matters. Yeah. It doesn't have to be big. You don't have to be rich. There you go. <laughs> there you go. You just heard it from Sophia Bush herself. So like, to go out there and do this. Please, I love you. You love the world. I know you do because you support me and you understand how much this means to me. So I want it to mean a lot to you too because I personally am incredibly affected also because my boyfriend, Sky, obviously has his brother in jail who is wrongfully imprisoned. And that obviously it hits home for me because I love him very much. And, I, and obviously he wants his brother around to watch his daughter grow up and he wants his brother around to be there with him through his success. And his brother is also an incredible musician and he deserves to be um, out here in the world pursuing his dreams and his gifts and not, you know, in a prison cell forgotten about. That's not what any of us deserve in this lifetime. So if you guys can... And if you agree with the initiative, which you better agree with the initiative, because I'm, <laughs> I'm gonna smack you. Other, I'm just kidding. I love you, um, and please do anything you can. I'm gonna be posting very soon on how you can get further involved. Thank you so much. And one more time. Oh, one more time. One more time. It's reformlajails.com reform or at or at reformlajails on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook. Follow right now. For now, so you can help get and the word out. Donate. As little as a dollar, who whatever you can donate, donate. We need the money and sign the petition if you're a resident in LA. And if you're not registered to vote, register. Please register to vote. If you're about to turn 18, we need you. We need you in this upcoming election this year. And we and register to vote if you're in LA. You can also sign this petition for us. We need 170,000 signatures at Reform LA Jails. Com. John Legend just tweeted out. John Legend just did it. I'm gonna do it. I'm kidding. Okay. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I love you guys. How do I stop this? There you go. <laughs>